Nice and tight, just right. Shonda and Tyrese. Who knew this storyline would have a sequel? And who is this? You know what? You got some pretty eyes, you know that? So, Tyrese moved on real quick. This is a woman with the pretty eyes. Let's see how pretty they are. Okay, they kinda they kinda cute. She kinda cute. I met Tracy at an art gallery. I was looking at some art and I seen a woman just standing all alone. That's where you find the peoples. That's where you find the peoples. Art gallery. He was talking about laundry mat. What was he talking about? Car wash, grocery store. Uh, that's what he was talking about. But yeah, art gallery. That's where you find some sophisticated people. No bum is going to be walking around in an art gallery. I'll tell you that much. So Unless they're trying to steal the art. That's a whole different story. I struck up a conversation. You're gorgeous. Yes, yeah. Oh, she says you are too. You rarely hear people talking about guys being gorgeous, more like handsome, but yeah, this is an interesting conversation. I feel like two people just starting to get to know each other and we're just like, we're all up in there with the cameras and everything, looking at this these awkward first stages. You know she's probably gonna end up calling you and wanting money. So she asks, has Shonda called you? And he's like, no. And it's like, why do people lie on these shows? Why would you lie on a national, but now pretty much international television show when everybody's going to see the truth afterwards anyway? You're going to watch it. You're obviously going to watch it. You want to know how they portray you. You want to know how they portray you on the show. So you're going to watch. Mm. Okay. I don't know Shonda on a personal level, but I can relate to her as far as um, being a prisoner because I have been one at one time. How did, okay. How is it that? What are the odds that you meet somebody, they're a prisoner as well, but you didn't meet them through that inmate.com or whatever the heck this online website is that they go to? What are the odds? Does it just attract these people? That's so strange. You know, she was younger than me and sometimes you gotta grow up. So you Amen. You ain't got nothing to worry about, baby. You're my baby. Speaking from Um, he's eating and he's he, he's got a toothpick in the mouth in his mouth. Do you see that? And he's eating. I never understand this toothpick in the mouth thing with mm, a lot of guys. Please explain what that is about. Please explain. Because if you're really walking around going like, mm, let me do some flossing. Yuck! I don't need to see that. But why do people do that? And it's especially in America, like. Other places you will not see people walking around. Well, well. No, not really. I don't know. It's weird. It's very hard to trust people today because you don't know what they're thinking of. That food look good. Uh, where their mind is at. So I'm not rushing anything. She's not. He's on the salt. I'm not rushing anything. But I'm excited to see where this goes. I'm so happy that that woman is around his age. Oh, I'm so happy. Guess what else I'm gonna tell? No, he's really about to eat with that thing in his mouth. I'm confused. You guys, this is a health hazard. Don't do this. Don't do this. What? He's really about to, huh? With that toothpick in his mouth. But why? And yeah, he says he's gonna tear her up, tow her up. Guess what else I'm a toe up, tail up. I know these accents from all these different peoples, I don't know. All right, all right, all right, let me find somewhere to put a toothpick. I find this dangerous, you guys. And it is dangerous. You know how many things get found in people's intestines and stomach and esophagus stuck there because they put weird stuff in their mouth? Do not do this. I can't stress this enough. This is crazy. Weird conversation. Weird conversation. I don't know, you might have told me. You're, you're fine out the night. Tyrese, you are an old man. 
You are an old man. Please stop the nonsense. Nice and tight, just right. <laughs> You guys met each other at an art gallery. Y'all can't talk about art? You sitting over here. This whole conversation has been like this. You got... <laughs> no, wait. You got beautiful eyes. You're gorgeous. So are you. Ashanda called you? Nope. Well, you don't have to worry about that. You're my baby. Guess what else? I'm a tail up. I know. You tell me. Nice and tight. Just right. This was the whole conversation, you guys. We've just sat here and watched two grown people talk like they're 17 and in high school. Madness. If this is now, I even didn't catch her name. If this is not now going to be these two people and Shana's like deuces, then I don't know what these people are still doing here. Your storyline is up. Unless Shanda will be back. Guess we'll have to wait and see. So stay tuned. If you're not already part of family, make sure you hit mom some as well as subscribe button, comment because I really want to know what you think. Like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell while you're at it. I'll see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow. This is a lifestyle channel. We do daily videos up in here, but other videos as well because it's a lifestyle channel. In any case, in the meantime, make time for glorious life. It's time to start. What? Living it right. God bless. Mm -hmm.